blood to the beat with my hopes and my dreams like a boat in the sea let it ride from the west to the east be the best you can be let the rest rest in peace while i try what's goody fam you already know who it is it's shaka shine and i'm coming back get it with another reaction on shaka shine reacts today we're doing a little bit of up church and this is get fudged on now for the people that have been hitting that like button, hitting that subscribe button, hitting that comment button, you know me. This is a channel to give you credit when credit is due, and y'all deserve all the credit. So I got to say thank you. Truly appreciate every single one of y'all. With that being said, for the people that are waiting on their requests, as you can see, we're getting it every single one of y'all. If I set it put on the list, it's on the list and it's coming up. But you can always skip the line by hitting me with the donation. Links right underneath the like button. And I'll make sure I get your reaction out within 72 hours. Now, as far as this goes, this is part of the uh, Upchurch saga. If you guys have not seen the other videos, this probably will not make sense. So make sure you check out the playlist. It's either under the Upchurch playlist or the Upchurch saga playlist. So um, I'm pretty sure I made the playlist just for this saga. So make sure you check it out. We also have a ton of just regular Upchurch reactions of his music. So check that out as well. All of them are in, on playlists. But if you're coming back for some more info on the saga, for another update, then let's keep it going. I'm sick of Ryan Up Church. I'm sick of all you motherfuckers. Up Church. Mm. Baddest motherfucker. Watch this dude. And I really like his Little House of Horrors uh, plant back there. I love that movie. And uh, so that little life size um little plant of it i think that's dope Grammy, another one so this looks like some old footage of him this doesn't look like it's recent unless he shaved his face because the last one i just saw he had a full beard so non-fucking-stop it's 11 13 at night my, my wife's gotta go to work in the morning Oh, is that right? Your wife has to go to work in the morning? Well, <laughs> does she have to put your fucking diaper on and make you a bobble, too? Fucking. Imagine being a woman tired as fuck from work, having to come home and change this big, goofy-looking motherfucker's shitty diaper. <laughs> he just runs... That's messed up. ...to the front door and opens it with his fucking big, ugly, whitey tidies with a fucking shitty diaper underneath it. <laughs> He's pointing at his ass. Diaper! Diaper! Or your fucking macaroni Flintstone stuck to your neck done dried there. Then got into some sticky notes and stuck them everywhere and they got little stick figures of the mayor on them. <laughs> like, this is what I gotta go through. Oh, boo fucking hell. What you should go through is the goddamn front door at about 5, 6 o'clock in the morning and go find a job. <laughs> now, now, don't go through. Okay, see, that kind of stuff, I don't really understand. That's your property. If you break your property, that's just you having to pay more for its, your own stuff. Like, I get that you might be pissed off and whatever, but hitting and breaking your own stuff is not anywhere near a solution for anything. If anything, that's just going to make you more mad once you calm down and realize what you just messed up. On your phone like that, your wife ain't just going to go, bang, you another one. Peace the fuck out, bitches. What the hell's that? What are you, an 80 pie sorority girl going to Panama for the first time? <laughs> hey, peace out, bitches. Yeah, bitches. Paintsville. I just want to talk to y'all for a minute. Well, the rest of Paintsville's probably at work. And, uh, and let y'all know, man, you know. Know what? <laughs> you didn't say nothing yet. That's facts. <sighs> it's, it's pretty messed up that we have people in our hometown that's that's got malicious intent. <laughs> what, you think you're special or some shit? You've been living under a rock? Welcome to the fucking world, dog. Yeah, for real. Every, I mean, not everyone. There's tons of people, though, that have malicious um, intentions. Period. Oh. For me and my wife. <laughs> well, goddamn, son, you froze, didn't you? It's just a dog. It'll be all right. A church must have sent that dog here. Who put that dog there? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Watch what we say now. He might get on here and tomorrow telling you his cash app, being like, because of Upchurch, I developed a phobia of dogs. Because of him, the mayor told you to do it. 
Now, now, we can't go giving him a phobia of dogs. Then why his old lady's putting his fucking diaper on and making his bobble in the morning? She can't put on Scooby-Doo anymore. <laughs> Every time he sees Scooby-Doo, voice. <laughs> How many times does Upchurch gotta clown you before you just kind of, like, relax? Because, I mean, me personally, I would have just been like, you know what? Whatever. Like, up church he has almost 3 million subscribers i think at the time of this recording he's at like 2.8 million something ridiculous insane congratulations up church but um compared to your what i assume i've never even seen his youtube channel so i don't know how many he has but nowhere close i guarantee you you do not have anywhere close to almost 3 million subscribers so after like the first or second time i would have just stopped because obviously up churches is reaching more people plus people are already going to be biased towards up church because they're his fans you know what i'm saying don't get me wrong some fans might not like this and might not listen to his music anymore but i guarantee you it's such a small percentage is is practically zero so anyways let's keep it pushing you gotta freak the fuck out and go 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 grab his wife and like try to hang on her and shit and make her late for work. She's the only one that works in the house. She has to go to work. It's crazy that 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 an officer will go as far as having his wife go file charges on me. This dude's scared because a, a cop filled out some paperwork. Because I'm exposing the situation he's done that he's done. If people can't see that this is nothing but retaliation. My gosh, you are blind. You ever think everyone else just, you know, sees it for what it is? And in your head, it's like dramatized? I mean, you already do go, peace out, bitches. Y'all are blind, man. Yeah, well. I well, all you got to do is have the right evidence. You just say stuff without having evidence. That's really what it is. You just want people to believe you. Now, if you have evidence... People wouldn't have anything to rebuttal because you had the evidence. But it's just hearsay, she, uh, he say, she say. You know what I'm saying? It's a whole bunch of hearsay, so. We all wish you were blind so you couldn't find your fucking phone to be a complete fucking retard on every day. But, you know, we're not getting our wishes. So here, all you tax-paying citizens out there are going to pay for a court, uh, for, for me going to court, guys. Y'all are paying for me to go to court. And I'm innocent. What, do you want everyone in the world to stop paying taxes so you don't have to go to court? <laughs> yeah, like, that doesn't even make sense. There's plenty of innocent people that go to court. That was the whole process of going to court is, I mean, don't, you know what I'm saying? Like, you're proving, they have to prove that you're guilty. But that's, like, the whole point. There's tons of, not only that, there's tons of people that went to court and actually was convicted, and they were still technically, like, they were innocent. So, like, come on now. That's not really a, like, a good point. <laughs> <laughs> Innocent. Is he like trying to be cool? Like, shit, man. <laughs> he's acting like he's fitting to go to trial or something. I'm innocent, bro. I'm innocent. You're getting charged with stalking somebody. Just, you know, stop stalking people. That's all you gotta do. You know, it's, it's like it's it's like a damn dream, man. That, that uh, a nightmare. Yeah, those are opposite. Y'all can't imagine. <laughs> Y'all cannot fathom. It's apparent you've seen me say the word fathom. Good job. You said it the correct way. Now go make your macaroni frog art. Y'all cannot fathom what I go through on a day-to-day -day basis. Everyone sees what you go through on a day-to-day -day basis. Because you post it on YouTube. You go through my videos all day. And uh, fucking kiss the pictures, lick the pictures. Fuck, I don't even want to know what you do with the pictures of me. <laughs> y'all can't fathom it. Okay, good job. We, we, we get it. You learned a new word. Man, if y'all can't see what's going on in this situation with me and, and, and John Holbrook and, and the mayor and, and the county attorney, Mike Endicott. And Spider-Man and Batman and, and Jesus. Yeah, and some lady in Idaho. Who's rich as fuck? She did something to me too. Ow, my ankle. She did it. Come on, y'all. If y'all don't see how the lady and I 
Hey, Ryan, I'm just letting you know if you want to talk about Idahoans, you know what I'm saying? I'm kind of there right now, so you can always just swoop my name in there, you know. Swoop that in there. Oh, I never met and broke my ankle and made it where I can't work no more, then I, you must be blind. If y'all can't see this shit, y'all blind, man. See, what this dude don't understand is nobody gives a fuck. People have shit to do. Exactly. All right? Even people who watch my stuff, they, they ain't watching me all day. They got shit to do. Yeah. They got responsibility. Straight up. I mean, we know you don't know nothing about that, but your wife does. Y'all blind. Y'all need to open your eyes. Yeah, man. It's it's everyone else, not you. You, you got it all figured out. What's wrong? You don't want nobody to see your vagina? Does it look weird or something? He's dumb. He's so dumb. <laughs> He's so dumb. Oh, God. Okay. Are you talking about whooping my wife? <laughs> Look at this dude. Look at it, dude. Sitting on the couch, Indian style, with his little saggy titties and his fucking spaghetti arms. Sucking on that cigarette, boa. Fucking. Talk about whooping my wife. You talking about whooping my wife? <laughs> Your wife is in the next room laying down. She probably hurts. She's like, I wish somebody would give me a spanking. <laughs> <laughs> Your ass ain't doing it. Let's answer this call. My wife has to work tomorrow, you guys. I'm gonna yell excessively in this phone that fucking no one else. That's what I was wondering too. Like you said your wife had to go to sleep. Oh, I had to wake up early. And so why are you doing what you're doing? Like, just go to bed. Just talking out of. <laughs> Let's answer this real quick. See what they got to say. Hello. What's up? Hello? They hung up. Yeah, they you know, they don't know what to say. I, I've got, I've, I've responded. Who was that? You act like we're supposed to know who that is. I don't even. Yeah, I've got, I've, I've, I've responded. Your brain's fucking stuck. You got me. <laughs> Y'all about to see. Yeah, yeah, we about to see. We about to see while your wife at work making the cheese and you sit at home for free. That's why after work she goes and gets the D because you gonna sit at home on the sofa on your iPhone till three. <laughs> <laughs> He's so I'm dumb. A, I'm gonna I'm 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 stay live while these people call a hundred times. Damn, bro, say some cutty for the rest of us. Fuck. <laughs> the dude sitting on his couch gonna stretch his balls while <laughs> to say some cutty for the rest of us. <laughs> Oh, that was a good one. Oh, I gotta take that. Bro, break. say some cutty for the rest of us. Fuck. Oh, that dude got sitting me. on his couch gonna stretch his balls while people call him all night and don't say shit. Alright. What I'm gonna do? I bet your wife is like super turned on. Mmm, I love the way Johnny yells Dagburn in the phone all night. That's right. Dude's a real life Bob's Burgers character. Wow. This is not a. Dude's a real life Bob's burger character. Like, come on. Oh my gosh. Hands. Okay. Ah. Alright, let's see. What I thought your wife was sleeping. She has to wake up early in the morning. You just disrespectful. Like, come on. Ah. That's what I think about you, motherfucker. <laughs> what were you talking about? You, you fucking, you muppet looking fuck. What? What? Like, this is what I gotta go through. Hell yeah, dude. <laughs> you know, you sound like a dying D Walt drill. Oh wait, you don't work. You don't know what that sounds like. Now look, we already know you're gonna cry us another one and all that other good shit. But this time, you have to make 20 videos before I make another one. 20. Daddy needs 20. I'm a superstar, I need 20. Cause I- <laughs> Straight up letting them know. Got a new hobby that I really love, magnet fishing. <laughs> Uh, 
That's deep. You probably shouldn't do it. Your arms will get really. Oh, okay. He might have videos on that. If he has videos on that, let me know. Put it in the comments. We might have to go check that. those those uh, out. I really fast. The heaviest thing you've picked up in the past five months is that fucking sticky ass iPhone you got. And all you've done is flirt with me. Plus, I'm about to start doing magnet fishing vlogs. And I See, that's what I thought. I thought he said at one point that he's about to start doing more vlogging, so to break it to you but hanging out with my buddies and fishing and stuff is way cooler than sitting here watching you do whatever it is you do <laughs> and i'll leave you on this you little squid billy you little squid All billy you, to... <laughs> you little squid billy oh that's messed up your problems go away for real is be a man go to work pay bills play with your kids do nice shit for your woman. Take her out to eat. Rub her fucking feet. Go get her dinner one night. Something. You fucking bum. You can't do that. You're not a man. Dang. Simple as that. You let him have it. I'm All right. All right, all right. So... I would have to say, I mean, it seems like he was giving him some pretty good advice. Can't lie. It is what it is. Um, I personally think that Upchurch is still in the right. Again, he doesn't have to clown him as hard as he does, but it is kind of entertaining and it is funny from time to time. Can't lie. So, again, homie, if you want Ryan to stop talking about you, just stop talking about Ryan. Like, just stop. I guarantee you. Like, the only reason why he's hitting you up is because you keep making more videos. You started the videos, and he's just been replying ever since, and you get almost mad that he's replying. So, I don't know what you expect. Either way, it is what it is. If you're making it this far, you might as well hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, hit that comment button. If you're already doing that and making it this far, then I gotta say thank you. Truly appreciate every single one of y'all. Until next time, you know what it is. I'll be back with another reaction tomorrow.